Hello, my YouTube family. <laughs> it's kind of late. It is um, August the 12th, 2017. Um, I'm coming to you to give you... Um, I'm at my seven-month um, post. I um, was well, like... Well, I went to the doctors for seven, on the 10th of August. So... I was like um, seven months and like one week. And I had a very good um, report from the doctor, which I'm very, very happy about. Um, I am down. I am in Wonderland. I told you guys I was going to get there. <laughs> um, I should have been doing like a more happier video. <laughs> but. I am in Wonderland. I am at 197. So from starting weight, I'll give you my stats. Starting weight, um, 290. And um, well, that's when I did, that's what I was when I got sleeve. I'm sorry, it's late, everybody. When I got sleeve, I was 290. And I am down to 190, 197. So, big difference. I am loving it. Loving it, loving it, loving it, loving it. <laughs> I am working hard at it. I am eating right. I am exercising. I'm going to the gym at least three times a week, I am walking, 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 so much walking. And I'm doing like steps, like I go to the um, soccer field where my kids go to school at, and I do like up and down the bleachers, up and down the bleachers, which in the beginning I could only, I could barely walk up one time, but I'm, man, I'm doing things that I never thought, you know, I would be able to do, but, you know, it's, you know, grace of God is just all working out. My doctor was very, very proud with my, I had an appointment on the 10th, and she said that I'm, my BMI is at 31, which still puts me in the obese stage, but when my um BMI gets to be under 30 like 29 that would put me in the um just the overweight stage so like you know I'm almost there she said and I know by the next visit you'll be down so I don't know I'll still be in overweight but at least I won't be in morbidly obese or obese <laughs> so it's, it's working out. I'm loving it. Like, I, even though it's not, you know, regular BMI or normal BMI, I love where I am. Even though, like, I'm 197, like, I feel good. I think, you know, I look good. Um, and me feeling good and being healthy is the, the most important. So, I'm just happy with that. You know what I mean? I'm happy to be able to go in stores and buy regular clothes and try on clothes. I'm, man, I put on, I think I posted it in my group the other day. I went into a store and I, and I had some leggings on and I tried on juniors, size 11, distressed jeans, and they fit so nicely even I even put them I even tried them on in the middle of the store I put them on over top of my leggings and man to my surprise <laughs> I had the 11 and I had the 13 I told my son I'm gonna put these 11s on first <laughs> not thinking they would foot fit and they did so I don't know just those small things make me very happy you know, so I'm very happy with that. Anyway, I just wanted to come and give you my update of my doctor's appointment and let you know that everything is going so well right now. 
this weight loss I'm rocking. Um, she did look at my excess skin because I have a lot of skin like on my stomach, which I don't think is um, all skin yet. I still think I have some losing to do in it. But she said because it like hangs kind of low that she knew that I would be um, approved to be able to, to take take the pouch off. So once that time comes, well, she made me aware that I have to be at the same weight for like three months before they would do anything for it because they want to make sure that I'm at a stable weight and I'm not constantly, sorry, my pants is wrecked. So constantly keep losing because they don't want to do the surgery then I still keep losing more weight and then I still have a you know a pouch so and then she said also said that they would do that and do a breast lift all at the same at at one time so I don't know about all that but we'll, we'll see what happens when that time comes she said usually you're over a year out well, I think she said, like, you know, anywhere from 15 months to 18 months. In between that time, then they'll start, like, looking at the skin. So, I'll worry about that when that time comes. But for now, I'll wear my girdles, and I'll cover it up. <laughs> but, you know, it is what it is. Um, I don't think there's really much more to say right now. It's kind of late, so, you know, I'm just kind of rambling but i just wanted to say hello and check in and give you guys my stats and let you know that i'm doing good seven months out <laughs> i think i go to the doctors in two more months two months or something like that so hopefully by then i will be in just the overweight stage <laughs> we'll see trying to get to the normal she said my normal is one six at, um, for me to be in normal BMI, I will need to be like 150. I don't know if I can um, get down to that small. I'm, you know, like like you worry about like the way that you're gonna look. Like you don't want to look too sickly. Like like right now at the way that I'm now, I feel strong. I feel healthy. You know what I mean? So. In my head, I think 175 is, is is good for me. I don't think, I don't really know if I want to get any smaller than that. And I don't know, but I guess we'll see how things go. I don't know if I'll be able to control it or, <laughs> or not, but no, I don't know. I'm liking where I am now, and I'm liking the way that I'm looking and when. when putting on clothes and things like that but yeah we'll see how things work out <laughs> we will see but I just wanted to say hello and I will check in again I'll check in at a different time when I'm more awake <laughs> but thanks for watching my page thanks for subscribing to to my page and you know, have a blessed night.